Well, this was uh, just a, a nondescript uh, building in uh, Chinatown in uh, Manhattan, and it uh, did perform some basic services such as uh, renewing driver's licenses, but prosecutors allege it also had a more sinister purpose. And in fact, these two New York residents were working on behalf of the Chinese Ministry of Public Security. And in at least one instance, they helped uh, track down a Chinese dissident uh, living in California. And that dissident uh, was then harassed uh, several times. Um, and this uh, the secret police station was set up just over a year ago. It was uh, raided by the FBI last October. And uh, just today, uh, these two New York residents uh, were um, arrested. Um, and uh, this is uh, allegedly part of a network of uh, about 100 uh, such uh, secret police stations uh, operating uh, around the world, according to uh, watchdog uh, groups. Um, and uh, the men um, have also been charged with obstruction of justice for uh, deleting um, text messages and other data from their phones where they were in communication uh, with the Chinese government. Uh, also today, we saw the US um, uh, make charges against uh, 34 uh, members of the Chinese uh, Ministry of Public Security uh, who are based in China using uh, US social media platforms to uh, target dissidents uh, as well. So it's, uh, it's quite, a, quite a clampdown in this uh, ongoing battle.